excited about making my video game videos. So I'm going to go through and basically show you what I'm working with, where my collection's at right now, and whatnot. Alright, so basically here's the majority of the collection. These are just my Nintendo games. Currently I'm at about half of all U.S. release games and the, uh, the third party ones. Now over here we got my Super Nintendo games. Only about 30 of them, but the, we got the games like Hurricane 2, Hockey and Rocky 2, Hockey and Rocky, uh, all the RPGs. Most of the games are like 40 to 100 bucks. Um, pick those up first. Over here are some like, you know, $100 NES games. Well, not 100 but, you know, 40 to 50 Panic Restaurant, you know, DuckTales 2, stuff like that. Um, so we have Super Nintendo. Here's my little collage of some manuals I had. Over here is my, my Turbo Graphics games. Do, do, do. Got a few of them there, as you can see. Okay, so over here we got the Nintendo. Over here is a couple more Super Nintendo. There's Mega Man X1, X2, and X3. Got some video games back there. A couple things I just Super Nintendo 64 uh, Genesis. I don't have those systems right now, but I'm buying the games at uh, Goodwill anyways. There's some my skinny puppy CDs. Great Canadian industrial music there. Good video game music too if you're tired of what you're listening to. Or if you're grinding a MMORGP. Some spawn stuff. Okay, right here is where all my new Japanese imports are going. Uh, for my Super CD ROM, my PC engine. My first one I've gotten so far Star Parodia. Amazing shooter. Just an amazing game. Um, these I also got my spine cards with these because I'm buying them from Play Asia. And Play Asia does a very good job. Uh, sending you just really nice collector's stuff. They give you the spine cards with the game. Now, just to give you an example of what the difference is, uh, Dracula X, uh, Castlevania X, uh, Chino Rondo goes for about, it's worth about $174 right now. You can get it for about 159 stuff online with the spine card. Without the spine card, it sells for about 90 bucks, 100 bucks. So that's just how big of a difference to collectors these little spine cards mean, and they basically go on the spine. Here's a couple more of my uh, cue cards. I've only got six games the hue cards. Um, we got Bomberman. Probably too dark there, but Bomberman, you know, Air Zonk. Bomberman 93. And then a couple Time Cruise. So only a couple of them are in the cards. Most of my games, like I've shown before, are in the uh, actual CD cases. So, over here we got the systems. Hopefully there's enough light here. My Nintendo, one of those crappy Super Nintendo Nintendo things. I have that just to play imports and PAL region games. Um, playing Dragon Fighter right now. Awesome game. If you got 20, 25 bucks or no more person selling it for less, get that game. Super duper game. There's my Super Nintendo. The only things that have gone yellow on my Super Nintendo are the plastic right around the controllers. So other than that, my Super Nintendo turned out very good. And it looks like it got all the plastic that was actually treated with the uh, the anti-fire resistance or whatever. Um, down here are my my babies, my Turbo Graphics with the Turbo Booster. Just picked up a joypad, uh, that thing for it. Got some controllers back there. Um, I love my Turbo Booster. That's awesome. Gives you audio, video cables back there to hook up to your TV. Uh, totally increases the sound quality of games for Turbo Graphics. Now, this here is your Turbo Duo. Um, you put your card in right there. The heat cards go in there, and then CDs go there. Um, this plays Japanese imports, whatnot. It does not play import cards though, but it plays all the CD games for the PC Engine: CD-ROM, Su Super CD-ROM 2, and Arcade CD-ROM. Some of them you need cards for, but most um, it plays pretty much every import that you get, um, which is right now that's that's the collection I'm filling up. So uh, we're gonna get we're gonna get some of these games played here, and I've got a couple games coming in from uh, more games coming in from Play Asia. Um, got Summer Carnival '93, the Nezar, or whatever that's called, and some other games. So we'll be getting to some of them soon. All right, see you guys.